Hi guys. Today I'm going to be making um pebbles, like magnetic pebbles that you can stick on a whiteboard, dry erase, dry erase board, and like magnetics like your refrigerator and stuff. By the way, but I'm going to be making them a little bit differently. We're going to be putting glitter on the backs of them and maybe even make some glow in the dark. So, let's get on to this. So first, you'll need Pebbles, glitter of your choice. I have this fine glitter, and I have some of this like chunky glitter. This has stars and, sorry, this has stars and um, hearts in it. Magnets, need Mod Podge, to uh, glue the glitter on. And then if you want to make glow in the dark ones, you'll need glow in the dark paint. So let's get started. So first, you're going to take the rocks, and the glitter of your choice. I'm gonna do red glitter first because it's Valentine's Day is coming up. So I have this mat right here, so I can dump the glitter on it. It'd be a lot easier instead of just sprinkling the glitter on. I'm going to do that. I'm just going to dump some glitter on this mat. And I'm going to do this. I have a mixture of the glitters right here because I had like a bunch of these tubes. And those tubes broke, so I just like dumped them all on this one. So I'm going to do one of these, this one too. If I can get it open. <clears throat> there we go. So one of this one. And next. Dump the, a little bit of glue. That is not mixed up well enough. If you guys like these DIYs and give it a thumbs up. Subscribe. And let me know what you would want to see next. I'm going to be doing Pinterest DIY. I'm going to be finding DIYs that I like on Pinterest. And I'm going to be testing them and seeing if they actually work. So this is one of them. So I'm going to take the glue and paint the bottom of the, the stone. And then like stick it to the glitter. Get it all stuck up on there. So then it looks like this. And then you're going to let this dry. So just like stick it over to the side and let it dry. Do another one. Glue the bottom of. The reason why you're going to use Mod Podge is because Mod Podge, uh, it dries clear so then you can't see the, like, the glue residue. And then that way you'll be able to see the glitter right through the rock or the stone. Do this one. So it looks like this. You can't really see because my light's too bright, but yeah. Like that. And then you can already, you can see. I don't know if you can see that. There you go. You can see it through the stone. So let that dry. Oh. I want to do one with a chunky glitter. Dump some of this out. This is used for like nails, but I don't really, I don't wear nail polish. Maybe I'll do a video of me painting my nails because I never paint my nails. And if you guys like the video, you can tell me. And don't mind my messed up fingers. I broke these two fingers when I was younger. So yeah. If you want a story on that, tell me. And I'll do a story time of it. Because it's actually pretty funny. Okay, we'll need another rock. I'm going to paint this stone again. And I just stick it on the glitter. Or the whatever. Let's stick it on my finger. Alright, so this is how this one looks. It's a little bit weird because the like, glitter is a lot to here. But it looks pretty on the back. I'm going to dip it in more glitter so then it like looks fuller than just that. There we go. So there's the back of it. And here's the front. It looks okay. 
It's not really my favorite, but it'll do. So I want to do the one with the purple glitter. I have purple. The tube's broken, that's why there's tape right here. So let's do one with purple. Should we do them purple and red? They have a little bit of red. We'll do purple and red. It might mix a little. So who's ready for Valentine's Day? I know I am. For Christmas, I got a... My fiancé and I got a um, $50 Red Lobster gift card. So we're going to be double dating with my parents. And we're going to go to Red Lobster. I haven't been there in a while. I love seafood. Comment down below if you guys love seafood too. Because I would love to know. So there's the purple and red one. There's a little bit of red in there. It looks really cute. Alright. So I'm going to let those dry. While those dry, I'm going to do the glow in the dark one. I have these glow in the dark, um, glow in the dark puffy paints, which is fabric glue, I guess. So they glow in the dark, and I might see if I can paint these on the back of them and see if they work. So I'm going to test that out too for you guys. So let's grab some of this right here. I might try to do these foggy ones too. Oop. I might try to do these foggy stones too. I need to hurry up because my camera's dying. So I'll do a few more. Okay. Here's the glow in the dark paint. You could paint the whole stone if you wanted to, but I'm only going to be painting the back of it. So here's one of them. And I'm going to do pink of the puffy paint and see if this works. I'm just going to squirt this right on the back of it and then I'll smear it around like paintbrush it around I guess I don't know you guys can't see that I'm sorry so do this so, so that's what that looks like it's pink if you guys can tell so I'm gonna let these dry and then I'll show you guys what to do next so this is how the glitter stones turned out to be. I um I repainted this one. This is the glow in the dark one. I repainted this one so it would glow better. And now I'm gonna show you how to um attach the magnets and show you the finished product. So you're gonna take your magnet, it looks like this, peel off the plastic part. There's sticky stuff on it already, but to make sure it stays even more, we're going to stick a little bit of Mod Podge to the stone. So like, put some Mod Podge down. Dab a little bit. Put it on the magnet. You would like it on. So first we're going to do this one. We're going to stick it to the back of the stone. It looks this looks like this. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah. If you're finding that the magnet doesn't stick, you can use super glue so that way it will actually stick better. So, I'm saying, so here's how the purple one looks. I don't know if you can tell because it's like iridescent on top. I'll stick this one to the puffy paint glow in the dark. So, yeah, the glow in the dark puffy paint actually does work. So just stick that down. This one got a little bit of glitter in it. I don't know if you can just a glow in the dark one. You can't tell it'd be it would be clear. You can kind of tell it's clear on the bottom, but it's really glow in the dark. So I'm going to now stick super glue on them because they're not sticking to the glitter very good. Just stick the super glue on the back. And stick the magnet on it. And if you're going, if you're younger and you're going to use super glue, make sure you ask for a parent's permission so that way you don't glue, glue your fingers together or something. So now it should stay. Oh, 
Alright, so here they are sticking on a magnetic board. On the dark one, this is the red one. They're sticking together. Chunky glitter one. The rainbow glitter. And the puffy paint on the dark. So there they are. You can see my reflection. So they stick, they're really cute. So yeah, they look really, really cute. So this Pinterest DIY was a, an excellent one. It definitely worked. So yeah, if you guys liked the video, give it a thumbs up. You can subscribe. And be on the lookout for more Pinterest DIYs. Bye.